Hello my YouTube family. Welcome to my channel. This is Anthony and I'm back with a large Dollar Tree haul. I know it's been a minute so I will make up for it with this haul. I did find some new items, some wish list items and yeah I found, I found a few nice items. So uh, I first want to say uh, I had a birthday Monday, May 21st. I turned 47. I am so blessed. I am thankful and grateful that I turned another year older. Uh, I wanted to do a challenge giveaway and I procrastinated about it and chickened out pretty much. I was thinking, oh, I might not get anybody to send in any entries or whatever. So I chickened out, but now I think I want to, I want to do it because I want to have something to journal uh, my 47, uh, my year of being 47. Um, and I don't know what made me want to do that this year because I do write in journals, but I figured I want to just journal the whole year of 40, being 47 years old. So I will make another video and explain, explain the challenge giveaway and go from there. So I will do that in a following video coming up soon. So I have the Dollar Tree haul and then I have a Tuesday morning haul which was a birthday little shopping spree that I went on that my husband sponsored for me. Um, so I'll have that video and I probably will do some um, swap shares that I've received in. We'll see how that how that goes. Um, so let's just jump right into this. Um, once again welcome to the channel. Okay first I picked up some of these Keebler they're graham snacks, the honey graham snacks. I picked up two packages of these. They are the Despicable Me 3. You get six little packages in in the pack. So you get uh, six one ounce bags. So I picked up two of those. I picked up one of these Arizona Mucho Mango drinks and this is 100% um, natural, no preservatives, no artificial color, no artificial flavor. And it says vitamin C fortified. It is a 42 fluid ounce bottle. So I picked this up for the family. Um, there is 25 grams of sugar and 27 on the carbs so yeah I won't be drinking that but somebody will a repurchase I picked up the Mrs. Freshly's and these are the fruit and grain cereal bars this is the apple cinnamon you get six bars in a box and these are really good. My girls like to have these for breakfast. It says on here may contain peanuts and tree nuts. So you have to watch out for that if you have allergies. <clears throat> oh, I found these Jiffy Pop. I haven't seen these in a long time. These uh, are the popcorn that you, sh you sh heat on the stove and shake and you shake it up and it pops so I picked up two of these for the girls for movie night we'll give those a try um, what does this say it is a 4.5 ounce and it is butter flavored there's an expiration date on here of January of 2019. So yeah, I thought that was something that the girls would enjoy. And then another repurchase are my So Natural 
freeze dried apple slices. I really like these. The ingredients are just the apples. So there are no added sugar in those. So I like to snack on these. <coughs> okay. Now I hit the jackpot on these mugs. My Dollar Tree got in a bunch of pretty mugs. The store manager said she googled these and I cannot pronounce it. It looks like it says uh, what was that? Platt's graph. I don't know if the F is silent or the P. Could be Fats Fats graph. I don't know. But something every day in their microwave and dishwasher safe. It says made in China. But I picked up this one. These are some really nice mugs. She googled these and she's some of them she said I think these were the ones that were around $4.99 or $5.99. And then I know there's a couple I picked up, they say Walmart on the bottom. So I'm not sure how much they were. Unless I've mixed up which ones were the ones that were $4.99. But anyway, these are a lot more than one dollar. So this one says with enough coffee. I could rule the world and then on the other side it says with oh no it's not coffee with enough caffeine I could rule the world and this is in a black and white print very pretty <clears throat> this next one I picked up says it's fun to be a girl and it has gold lips and it has a gold uh, pattern with red trim really nice so I picked these up with little uh, gifts in mind you know, can make a gift mug fill it up with some goodies so this next one I picked up says wild and free very pretty soft pastel colors Okay, the next one says pajamas all day. These are very nice quality mugs. This next one says grow happiness. And then this one says life is lovely and it's a pretty plum purple color with flowers and then the last one from that brand says home is wherever I'm with you in this pretty teal color oh so yeah those will come in handy if I'm in a pinch for a gift they're all set. I'll just have to fill them up. Then I picked up two of the ones that are distributed by Walmart. I picked up this orange one. They're nice and tall. Um, doesn't say how many ounces but it says made in China, Walmart.com, mug, tall, prints, orange. Very pretty. And then I also picked up this one in the teal. So, yep, I am set for mugs. I'm going to keep the orange and blue one, the tall ones, and put them in my kitchen. Okay, next I found some more of the t shirts. And I grabbed these for my son. His birthday is 10 days after mine, and it is coming up. His is on the 31st, so I grabbed him these t-shirts. He likes to work on cars and things, so I figure he wouldn't mind having some more because a lot of them are trashed with oil and all kinds of stuff. So it's a men's t-shirt, and this is the Fruit of the Loom brand. This one's in a 2XL, and it is in white. I got him two of the white ones. Uh, both of them are the 2XL Fruit of the Loom. 
and I've said before you cannot beat the dollar t-shirts okay this one is by Russell Athletic and it is in a extra extra large as well and it's in the red so I got him that one and then the last one I picked him up was the blue it's a nice royal blue and it is a 3XL and this one is Fruit of the Loom brand as well so I've got him that and that will go in his gift bag or box or whatever I picked up one of the tote bags and this one has the food on it so it's a little foodie tote bag it has drinks fries um, what is that tacos pizza there's candy and ice cream all kinds of stuff on their cupcakes and I got this I think I'm going to fill this bag for my daughter I had mentioned in a previous video how I'm going to put them a bag together with some things in it um, and give it to them so they can start their summer off it'd be a little you know welcome to summer or congratulations they finished their first year of middle school something like that just with some things in it that they can uh, keep busy with so I got that one for one of them and then I found this drawstring sack bag um, it is a 17 inch by 14 inch and it has treats on it as well and it has the skulls one of my daughters the one that uh, likes owls and um, emoji she likes skulls as well so I got this for her and I actually picked up some folders that oh here they are right here I picked up these Jot brand uh, portfolios you get two in a package and as you see there's one folder in there with that same print so these will go in her bag or maybe I'll give them one of each and she can hang on to these for next year for school when it starts back just to repurchase another uh, padded envelope which will be used for happy mail I picked up two packages of the decorative strings I've hauled other ones in the past and I like to cut the strings off and use them as die cuts so I picked up this one with the the flowers look like hibiscus flowers so you get like a pink a peach and like a mint green color in there and you get six feet of strings so got that one and then I also picked up this one with the flamingos and the birds the parrots and what is it um, like a toucan so really pretty and I, I like I said I'm going to use them in the craft in my crafting and they make wonderful die cuts see the base of my lamp it was one of my birthday presents from my husband I mean not birthday Mother's Day. This is one of my Mother's Day presents from my husband. It's the Eiffel Tower. I don't know. I've told you. I don't know. I've probably told you on over again. I love Paris themed items and I hope to go for our 20th year anniversary. That is the plan. He wants to take me so we shall see. So I got this. Love it. Okay. Back to the haul. I picked up some of the like felt decor and I was thinking of making a garland or something with these I don't know I just when I saw them I was like I want to do a craft with them so I was thinking of stringing these and hang some tassels in between that I would make so I got this flower and let's see if I can find the rest 
I picked up this flower and see they have glitter around the edges and they just say decor on the tag I also got this flower and then I got this green one here and these are just hanging with all the luau items and then this flower here so the the petals on them are different so some are pointy some are like rounded so I got those one two three four five and I plan on making one garland with those and then I got these that are more like a summer beach theme so I got the sun and same thing I planned on making a garland I'm sure we'll have some type of parties or get togethers family gatherings where I could just use these as decorations uh, I got the starfish I also got the crab and I think I got everything I'm not sure there might be one or two left but I got this and then I got the seashell so if I can turn these into a garland I will definitely share the process with you I'll make one and then try to do a video to show the other one I picked up this cute flamingo bag it has a party hat on it I thought that was super adorable let's see can you see this yeah has glitter around the feathers and on the flowers on one side and then of course the other side is not and then it has these cute polka dots in there I'm hoping you can see um, I am in my basement and the lighting is not the greatest I have all these lamps but it's still not the greatest but that's all I have right now to work with so I'm trying I picked up these three-in-one cotton swabs for some reason my cotton swabs have just disappeared I had them in a black container in the bathroom and that container is gone so I picked up that for now I'm not sure the quality on these you get 10 cotton pads you get 140 cotton swabs and 10 cotton balls I picked up some dot ballpoint pens and these are assorted uh, ink color it says it's smooth writing I like that variety of colors so I picked that up you get 10 pens in the package okay then I found these uh, jot notebooks I've been picking these up but these are some new patterns that came in uh, let me show you and actually one matches I think matches this mug pretty well it says you do you do you and it's like the same colors as this mug so it will probably go in this mug as part of the gift so you get that pattern you also get this pattern which would actually go with that as well and this one I love these dark plum colors that's mixed in there and then this one is in blue set in blue with gold writing it says be your own hero I thought those were very nice so I got that a repurchase just some unscented tea lights I picked up a package of these I like to keep those on hand 
I found these alphabet beads. I thought I could use those in my crafting. You get 325 pieces. Also, I went to look for an umbrella the other day and could not find my umbrellas. And I know I had two or three of those little black ones that Dollar Tree sells. So, I seen these on the counter. I went ahead and picked, picked this one up. This one has the red tip. Um, the other ones I had were all black. So, I just got one of those. These work well in a pinch. So, I think my daughters have taken them to school and left them in their lockers. That's what... I think has happened. Okay. Excuse the noise. I got some glass here that's wrapped up. I picked up three of the mercury looking glasses, the little the stars. So I got the one in blue. And these are very nice. Um, I got the silver. And then I also got the red. Okay, what else did I get? I picked up some more of the um, play packs from Dollar Tree. Uh, my son will be getting married in July, and they asked me if I can put a little bag together for the children that will be there. So when we're sitting at the table and they're waiting to get served or whatever, they have something that they can do, you know, sitting down quietly. So I've been picking up these play packs. I picked up some from Walgreens, and they, they were $0.99 cent at Walgreens, but I wanted like Ninja Turtle, a couple more boy ones. So I grabbed these at Dollar Tree. I picked up the, what is that, Popples? I'm not familiar with that cartoon, but I picked up that one. And these come with four crayons, one sticker sheet, and a 24-page coloring book. So, got that. Then I got the Hot Wheels one, and they all have the same amount of items in there and there's the Ninja Turtles and then I got Puppy Dog Pals and also Thomas and Friends so now I have a variety and I have I think I have 10 of them now and that's probably all I'm going to need to purchase of those um, to go along with those I picked up some of the Crayola crayons because I'm going to add more crayons, more colors to the little packets. Um, so I picked up three boxes of the 24 count Crayola crayons just to give them more of a variety of colors. So I will divide these up just if it's just two or three more different colors, I think that'll help. Uh, I found, and these were on my wish list. I was looking for the Crayola, Crayola uh, kits and also the poster sets that are in the box. So I picked up this one. These are the, this is the Enchanted uh, Forest. And you get uh, the crayons. So you can color and scan these. It's interactive. Um, so there's an app that you would download to use with this. So I picked up, I think, did I get three of those? Yeah, three of these, and I figured these would be for the older girls that will be at the wedding. So we'll see how, if this is what they, you know, had in mind, if they like the idea of what I chose. We'll see. I picked up, these were the other wish list items. So the these kits they make a really nice gift I got the Prince Disney princess so you get mini posters velvet posters um, glitter posters 14 posters t 
total and then you get the markers. So it says three glitter posters, five velvet posters, six mini posters, and five markers. I mean, you cannot beat that for one dollar. So that's that one. And these, you know, I'll hang on to them for gifts for my grandkids or my <clears throat> nieces and nephews or for gift baskets. So I got the cars, Disney Pixar cars. I also I got two of the princess. And then I picked up, <clears throat> excuse me, the Disney Frozen. I have a niece that loves Frozen. So I may hang on that, hang on to that for her. And then I got Mickey and the Roadster Racers. So I may pick up more of these. If they still have some, I didn't want to be greedy. So I just grabbed this for now. Because I think she only got in one case of those. So I didn't want to take them all. I picked up this sparkle color. It's a color sheet. You get two posters with these fashion divas on there with the markers. And I got this for myself. I figure I can include this in a journal. So I grabbed that. And then I picked up these Jot stickers. You get 1,000 stickers. And I like these because they have little, like, summer themes there. They are cupcakes. Somebody's car alarm is going off. I think, yeah. Hmm, it might be my son. So, anyways, you get, there's butterflies on one roll. There's some little bowls on one of the other rolls. And then there's some little flowers up there. There's some little birdies. Some more flowers. And this one down in the bottom that I can't see very well. It looks like it's a, <clears throat> what is that, princess or ballerina theme. But anyway, really cute. Oh, there's the pictures on the back. So yeah, it's like little clothes. But these are really cute. These also can be used can be used in your planner. So got that. And then I picked up some more stickers that were new. I'm on the hunt for the new washi tape. I haven't found any of that yet. But this is another new pop-up sticker. Uh, by Jot. You get 12 in the package. There's a flamingo, there's a drink, your beach chair, luggage, this little banner says uh, relax, there's a surfboard and an airplane, I thought those were really cute, did I get two of those, no, I only got one of those, so I got one of those, I think I just got one of each. Then I got this one. You get 12 in the package. It's like a girly theme. There's a feather, a guitar. It's like a um, a mock or knockoff Chuck Chuck Taylor tennis shoe. And a girl sticker. It's a smile. There's some headphones. My life. Look at the little scooter. Really cute. And then I got this Gone Fishing one. I thought this one would be nice to use to make a more masculine card, like a Father's Day card or a birthday card for a father or brother or son. So, got that. And you get 10 stickers in that package. And then in this package, you get 13. And this is more like a boy themed. Which, I mean, girls ride skateboards and all that, too. And there's another cute little tennis shoe. It says, awesome, dude. There's a bicycle. So these are more uh, masculine-looking colors as well. <clears throat> then I picked up some of those cute pencils by Jot. Jot has been coming out with a lot of really cute items. 
I picked up these and these have the little cupcakes and pandas and donuts on some then the other one is actually the same print this blue it's the same print is the the bag the foot foodie bag So yeah, and then the one in the middle is the same print as, uh, what that? it's a journal, a um, uh, composition notebook that I had purchased. It has that same print and has the little unicorn hiding in there and pizza and all that. So I got two of those and then I got one of this one. And this one has that print with the owl and the mint green. I have the matching bag and the little um, manicure set with that same print. So yeah, real cute pencils. Okay. Repurchase some gain. The Island Fresh. This smells really good. So I picked up one of those. Also, I picked up one of the jewelry hangers. I just picked up the white one. So you can put necklaces, earrings, and scarves on this. And they did have a couple other colors. I found this cute little sink plunger. It's called Sink It Plunger. And of course, I picked up the one that's turquoise. I thought those were so cute. They had a, a orange one. I think what was it purple and a red, I think. Or it may have been green, but yeah. I thought that was cute. Okay. I picked up some more packages of those jot notebooks where you get three in the package I want to do something with these for the craft fair so I have all these and I just decided to pick up some more every time I see them if, you know I'll try to grab a couple so I'll have enough like this the fox here that says hello this was one I had in mind for like happy mail or like if I do a fall craft fair, I could use these. I picked up some of the new list pads, and I really didn't need any list pads, but I thought these were really cute. And like I say, I can use these in Happy Mail, and I can include them in my journal, or whatever. So this one says, do not forget, like donut. So I got that one and it is 80 sheets I also picked up this one that says adulting and then this one that says hashtag goals I, I do apologize for the lighting once again I hope you can see it. and then come see Just a few more items left. I picked up one of these boxes. These are with the Father's Day display. So it is, this one is the suitcase or like bag, like messenger bag. And I thought that would be perfect to put something in for my husband. And the last items are just some books no intentions on reading them but I needed some more books for my journals so I picked up these two this is a nice size one I wanted some that are a little bigger that will give me more surface space for writing so I got these and these are just for the books that I alter I tear out some of the pages I like that cover after you take the jacket off but this one is called my history 
It's a memoir of Ant Antonia Frazier. So, got that one. And then I picked up this one for the same reason. I, I do like the colors. I like that in the inside, so I will be leaving that. This one might make a nice travel travel um, journal, but it's called The Book of Wanderings. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. A mother-daughter pilgrimage. So it might be interesting read, but that's not what I bought it for. And then I picked up this one. It's the No More Excuse Diet. Three days to bust it. Any excuse. Three ways um, to easy new habit eating habits three months to total transformation your real life plan for your best body ever and I'm actually uh, following a plan diet plan from a book that I purchased from Dollar Tree it's the 3121 diet and the author of that book was actually one of the trainers on the biggest loser so I am using that book um, I probably will read this one or go through it and you know pick out some things that might work but I was planning on altering this one as well I love the size of it and I like this white cover so I will go through it first though so that is my haul it's a very long haul uh, I hope that I showed you that I showed you some items that you can go out and look for um, so yeah, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please do so. I would love to have you to be a part of my small little YouTube family here. Um, I really uh, appreciate you all, all, all my subscribers. Thank you to the new ones that have joined the family. Thank you for your continued support. So until the next video, uh, peace and blessings um, and I will come back with a video about uh, my giveaway birthday giveaway so bye bye